It was a bit of a rough morning. Good morning. Good morning. I hope I digest. <laughs> I hope you digest too. Yep. Everyone has their shorts. Mm -hmm. Everyone has their shoes. Yeah. We have water. Yep. We have food. Yep. We have Mima. Hi. <laughs> So apparently I'm teaching voice lessons today because their voice lesson teacher canceled. Here we go. Yeah, so um, my first student is in like 25 minutes and then I have students all day until two o'clock. I don't even know how I feel. I mean, I'm excited because I haven't, I've been actually missing teaching and um, I have no idea what these kids are working on. I have no idea anything, but I'm a different teacher. So I'm sure that I'll be doing different things with them. So it doesn't really matter. I'm excited. It is. 12.38 p.m. I have taught I have taught six students <laughs> nothing nothing quite like a, like hitting the ground running I haven't taught lessons for over a year and I just taught six students back to back to back Woo. I have mom's camera I'm vlogging because she's driving. She's over there. She doesn't want to be irresponsible. <laughs> well, the reason why we started this is because of this song. Part of it is because we just saw a Lamborghini SUV. I did not know those existed, but bright apparently, green. apparently like, yes. Like yeah, it was super bright green, just like lime green. It was so bright, and it said Lamborghini. It looked really hey, cool. Yeah, I've never, car. I've never seen that. That was really cool. So, just thought I might tell you guys. We are Over stuck here. in traffic. Oh, you mean the pupils. But we stuck just went to see birds. Uh, not the pupil thing. Right? Oh, right, Ethan? Oh, yeah. It was awesome. It was amazing. And we're right by our house, and this happens. Why are you counting? Oh, you're counting the cars? Uh -huh. Oh, wow. It's over 75 cars. Which one's which? 80. And I forgot to bring my teeth stuff, so I haven't eaten since before we left. It's not wise. Yeah. I'm okay though. Day. I'm all right. <laughs> Have you vlogged about uh, what, what happened? You yes, did? Okay. yes, I I did. So yeah, tired. I taught seven voice lessons, uh, so and the last voice talk? lesson was an hour long. Jeez. And she didn't there's even she didn't trend. know what she was doing. That's so right. that was interesting. Trend. I didn't know. I mean, I taught I yeah. taught voice lessons. 100 cars. Ooh. I taught voice lessons. That's what I did. But like, they're getting ready for a recital or something. And so I'm like, I don't have any of the music. I don't know what I'm doing. But I, I winged it. And after I was done, I went and talked to my friend. She said, how did it go? And I said, I was winging it. And she said, how are your wings? I said, they're kind of tired, but it was fun. <laughs> <laughs> I would do it again. It's over 200 cars now. And it's Two. slowing down. It's slowing down. I'm starving. Oh. And it is. Wait for it. It stopped. It has officially. It's come to a complete halt. Look. Yeah. But don't let it go backwards. I was just going to say, it better not go backwards. <laughs> I don't think so. Okay. So that car right there is the last car of the and train. It's 213. It's and we are stopped. We are 213 cars. This, this is what I feel like hey, purgatory. Question, is. question. <laughs> so now we're in the very we're in the very front. We present to you the last car. And the train Can I get out? is very long. Can we walk home? Uh, can we walk home? Mantis style. And right <laughs> we decided to turn around. Mantis style. Mantis style. Yeah. Probably somebody sent word that they were blocking. Come on. Come on. Maybe you can, so, you can do maybe it. Maybe someone called. You can I do it. You can do it. I, I, I thought I could. I thought I could. I thought I could. 
we are back. I have eaten, so I'm not starving anymore. And I hear there is a shower running. So I think that Julian, oh, what's going on up there? Julian is taking a shower and he needs to work on an audition. Gabriel is outside playing basketball. He needs to tape an audition. Um, there's a lot that has to be accomplished before the end of this day. So it has really been a full day already and it is not even almost over. So <laughs> we're gonna sleep really well tonight. I know that for sure. Oh, I did not uh, expand on the whole bird thing that we were talking about. So I found out from a friend who knew about a person that had birds that we were possibly interested in. <laughs> and she is about 20 to 25 minutes from where we do our dance and tumbling and where I teach voice lessons, apparently, no, um, where I sub. <laughs> and um, so, oh. That's weird. It looked like my lip was bleeding. I don't think it is though. Anyway, um, we went to this lady's house. Um, there were a lot of birds. It was overwhelming. It was very clean. I was I was expecting like to get to this house and be like, Ugh, but. She loves these birds. She takes care of them. Um, super nice lady. Her husband was really nice. But now comes the fun part. We are going to be seriously discussing bird ownership. I really never thought that I was going to be in this position. I'm cautiously excited about it. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, what am I doing? <laughs> Listen. Yeah. That is a very familiar sound. It's the sound of the tree frogs trying to mate in my pool. I complain about it, but I have a pool again. So, <laughs> you know, whatever. Uh, we had that at our other house and now we have it here and it's good to have a pool. <laughs> I mean, it's not open yet and it'll probably be filled with tadpoles, but we have done this before. And yeah, I think this is my final clip. Gabriel got his uh, self-tape audition sent, well done and sent in, and he did a great job. And um, my voice is very tired. <laughs> After going... I was telling mom after going probably almost two years without teaching voice lessons and then having this many voice lessons back to back and even a virtual voice lesson, I did it. I actually did a virtual voice lesson. I don't really, I didn't enjoy it very much. I mean, it was an adorable seven-year-old boy, so like... I had fun with it, but I don't know if I did well. You know, it's like, I don't really know if he got anything out of it. <laughs> and he was in the back seat of a car going somewhere. So I'm sure his parents just loved <laughs> listening to me. <laughs> so anyway, um, uh, before bed, I'm going to go over Julian's Auditions. Speak of the devil. Huh?
Hi, Julian. Yeah, there he is right there. We're going to go over his auditions. He has just made mac and cheese, right? Are you here to tell us that the mac and cheese is complete? I'm here to ask where the pepper is. Oh, he needs to find the pepper. So, final clip. We have lots. We still have things we're doing before we go to bed. And tomorrow is going to be another fun-filled day. So, until tomorrow.